in the region 0 less than x less than or equal to 2 pi, the equation integral from 0 to x of sine of sine t dt equals 0 has no solution, one solution, two solutions, or three solutions. Interesting. I'm not sure exactly how to get started on this. It's always a little odd when you're taking multiple iterations of a trig function like this. Uh, but perhaps what we can do is think about when things are increasing and decreasing. Okay, so uh, yeah, we have 0 less than x less than or equal to 2 pi. So of course, when x is equal to 0, this is equal to 0. Uh, but we're not concerned with that solution. And when x increases uh, away from 0, this thing starts to increase. Like this is an increasing function. This is an increasing function uh, until x hits pi, no, uh, until x hits pi over 2, and then it decreases again, sorry, t, as t goes, is the answer just 0? Like, may, so I think let's also consider where this function is positive and negative. Um, This is positive for t between 0 and pi. Uh, not only is it positive, but it's positive and between 0 and 1. And so this is positive for t between 0 and pi. And then for larger values of t, this becomes negative but we're just sort of repeating the cycle. We're gonna, the, this function is going to look, when t is between pi and two pi, this function is going to be like an odd reflection of itself from zero to pi. And so the only time that this will hit zero again, this whole integral, is when x is equal to two pi. So this will be true but it won't be true for any smaller value here because, you know, this is, what if I write it like this? Okay, so this is of course only true when, well, this is always true the way it's written, but um, this is positive and this is negative, um, but they're never, this in absolute value, this is always going to be smaller in absolute value unless x is equal to 2 pi. Uh, and if I have a smaller, if I have a value of x less than pi in here, then this thing, the integrand is positive, and so the integral, integral can't be 0. Um, so I think the answer is just going to be b, one solution. But if I think of something more to say, or if I find a mistake, I'll put it down in the description. Thanks for watching.